Hi Flower Pots, well I'm back with a new review. You've been asking me, asking me to review the Star Skin Forming Peeling Perfection Puff from Glow Star. Um, it's a little puff that comes in a bag like that. It's in there. You add a bit of water, open it up, add a bit of water. It can be used up to three times. I don't know. I don't know. It's advanced exfoliation, skin texture smoothing, even skin tone, radiance boosting, deep cleanses. It's got really good stuff in it like carrot, tomato, turnip, broccoli, lactic acid, rice, olive leaf, aloe vera, cabbage. Right, okay. Um, cabbage. Right, so step one, we need to open this little bad boy, uh, thoroughly cleanse the face and leave it moist. This is quite moist. Tear sachet open, lightly sprinkle a few drops of water inside, create a rich lather, uh, squeeze the puff and whack it on your face for two to three minutes, then rinse it again, and then you've got beautiful, bright and naturally glowing skin. So that's the Star Skin Forming Peeling Perfection Puff. Um, I haven't used it before, you've been asking and asking me to review it, so I thought, Do you know what? I'll get it done today. Today's the perfect day. I went on a fucking date last night. Jesus fuck Christ. Smells a bit. Lemon sorbet. -y. So it's inside there. It's like a little puff. Okay. Uh, well, then makeup puff things. I'm going to add a few drops of water. So we're not at sink. I can't get tripod in fucking bathroom. So you can't swing a fucking cat in there. Not that I would do, I'm allergic to cats. So I'll add a few drops of water like that. Give it a bit of a shake. Yeah, I went on a fucking date last night. I'm on that Tinder Gold, right? And I keep getting reported and um, deleted because people don't think it's me. So I'm fucking giving up with it now. I'm fucking sick of it. Absolutely fucking sick of it. I'm not in a good mood today. Um, right, so that's the product there. You see it's all watering and puffing up. There it is. Star skin. So, oh, let's squeeze a bit of that out. Jesus. Uh, yes, I went on this day. I'm on that Tinder Gold. So, when you're on Tinder... Oh, that's nice. It smells like bloody... <laughs> lemon meringue. Lemon sorbet thing. Um, Lemon cheesecake. It smells like lemon cheesecake. So, you can't smell cabbage. It's always a plus. Uh, I went on that Tinder Gold. I've had a look through. And you get likes on Tinder Gold. And with Tinder Gold, you can see who's like, yeah, so you can either match or not match, it's up to you. Anyway, long story short, went this fucking date. And on paper, he's absolutely lovely. He's a proper 10, proper fit on paper, right? Nice. This is all right, this. It's, you know, when you're peeling stuff, you think it's going to be a bit abrasive. It's quite soft on the skin. It's nice. Uh, my roots need doing. I fucking know. I had to colour them in last night for my date. Otherwise, I'd have thought I was fucking 84, not 44. Um, what we're telling you. So, anyway, so I goes on this date and we were going to have a meal. We said, you've got to do it for two to three minutes. Uh, we were supposed to have a meal. But as soon as he walked in, I fucking knew. I thought, I ain't having no fucking meal with him. I don't like him. You just know, don't you? And you get, I got, got right mad at myself because I was like, Antonella, you're not shallow. Can be a bit shallow because I like dark hair, blue eyes, green eyes and dark skin and they have to be over six foot. Only because I'm tall and I don't want it to look like fucking mop and bucket. But anyway, up his come, bought me a drink, you know, kiss on cheek. Oh, you look nice. Oh, you look like your pictures. Have you got here all right? And all that fucking dog shit that you do. And I was mentally speaking to my vagina. I was like, come on, come on. Must be a bit of something. My vagina weren't bothered. I'm going to turn it upside down now for other couple of minutes. She weren't bothered at all. And I'm like, looking. I weren't looking, like, making it obvious, like, look what I've got. I was like, there must be something about him. And he were right nice, dark hair, blue eyes, six foot one. Nothing. Fucking nothing. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. It was like a fucking desert. Nothing. So I'm right angry with myself today because we did all the texting, no sexting, all the texting, you know, good morning, beautiful, have a lovely day, good night, can't stop thinking about you, can't wait. What a fucking calm down, I tell you. Anyway, he said, would you like to take him? 
would you like to look at the menu? And I said, I can't. I said, I'm really sorry. I, I've come. I said, but really, I, I wanted to say this, but I didn't want you to put you off or anything or, or, or rearrange. I said, but uh, I'm going to have to get back. We've got a few pro family problems. Because I just thought, what's the point of sitting there and wasting my time and his time? But then, me being known for being brutally honest, I didn't have the art to just say, bit there, there. I get a little bit here that's a bit bumpy. Well, weather's like this. I need a right good peel because I'm using that much shit on my face and I'm putting lots of sun um, stuff on, you know, like um, to protect your skin. What's it called, that stuff you put on your skin? Factor, sun factor. And that can be a bit cloggy, can't it? So I've noticed that my skin's not been, oh, that's better. Oh, yeah. So these pads, anyway, never mind me, Dace, it were a shower of fucking shite. My vagina did not want to play at all. Usually, though, she fucking flutters away. I can be in Tesco at counter, right? Putting me shopping through. Beep, beep, fucking beep. Look across and she's going, oh, I like him. And I'm thinking, fucking stop it, Vera. Calm yourself down. But yeah, yesterday on my fucking Tinder gold day is everything on paper. Everything on paper that I like. But no, nothing. Nothing at all. Sometimes you just don't have chemistry, do you? And you can't help it. You can't you can't help what you find attractive and you can't help what you like and what you don't like. You can't fucking help it. So he said, Oh, don't worry about it, these things happen. Um, blah blah blah, enjoyed our drink and he said, Oh, I do hope I get to see you again. And fucking stupid cunt here went, Yeah, definitely. Knowing, knowing that I will never ever see him again because I left, got in car, not even fucking turned engine on and I fucking blocked him. Not even put him in archives just in case. All because my fucking fanny wouldn't fucking flutter. Anyway, I'm gonna, just going to go and rinse this off. Wait a minute. Right, well, that's all rinsed off now. Do you know when I were reading it to you before, I were actually laughing, patting away. Um, carrot, tomato, turnip, broccoli. <laughs> Sounds like I'm making a fucking soup. So, there we am. Um, I've used the Star Skin Forming Peeling Perfection Puff. The details for the product are in the link above, should you want to give it a little click. Um, okay, so that's the puff now. You can either pop it back in the sachet or just hang it somewhere, let it dry. Next time you use it, put a bit, few drops of water on, off your trot again. Use it about once a week. Uh, you can use it three times maximum it says but I'll try and use it fucking five I like to get me money's worth every fucking last drop so yeah so it is a bit moist at the minute but it'll dry out and next time I want to use it a few drops of water unlike my vagina yesterday which wasn't moist at all uh, star skin forming peeling perfection puff would I use it again Absolutely, fucking loot uh, patented pre-dose peeling puff, which uh, exfoliates and removes dead skin cells. It also um, reduces the appearance of wrinkles and fine lines and creates an even skin tone. My skin is absolutely perfect now for putting serum on or creams on or shit on, whatever I want to do. So would I use it again? Yeah. Has it done what it says on the tin? Yeah. Is it a bit of a mess now, having it lying around? It is a little bit. That's the only downside. But I'm going to put it on a little dish on um, bathroom sink and it'll be ready for next time. So you asked me to review it. The Star Skin Forming Peeling Perfection Puff. And I have. And I like it. And yeah, report me all you want now on Tinder for not being me. Because it fucking won't be me. Because I won't be fucking going on it again. So there we go. See you next time, Floral Pots, with a new review. Take care.